Well, good morning, folks. It's that time again. It's Saturday, time for the Saturday shout outs. I have the list right here. So uh, please stay tuned. Hey guys, I'm back again. Um, let's go over this list. And uh, let's see what we're we gonna start out with. Oh yeah, I just wanna remind you to uh, check out a link down below uh, for the, to enter the September uh, Roadrunner Tackle Box. And you have till uh, October 6th to enter. Now from the previous comments and emails and shout outs, the uh, previous winners were pretty happy with it. And since I'm a small channel, it's probably pretty easy to win. So leave a comment because I'm gonna use a random comment generator to um, pick the winner. And I love corresponding with you guys, but if there's too many comments, I'm gonna prune them out. And I think this next time around, I'm just gonna prune out all of my comments so my name just keep popping up over and over again, right? So, um, Let's go ahead and start with the uh, shout outs. First one is the Tackle Boys. Looks like these guys mainly tackle the bass, but other species as well. In addition to documenting their catches, they've had some catch and cooks and an interesting competition. Not only are they into fishing, but turkey hunting as well. So they've had a very interesting unboxing and uh, you'll have to check out their channel to uh, see that. So the next one is number two, Team Kramer Fishing. Now, Mr. Kramer, along with his family, especially his daughter, are pretty serious with their fishing. Looks like they're targeting the bass also, but they also do a lot of multi-species as well. In addition to documenting their catches, they performed uh, product reviews and some catch and cooks. And they're also documenting some of their past road trips. It's a good channel. I encourage you guys to check them out. Next one is Spag Fishing, S-P-A-G Fishing. First, he is a uh, kayak fisherman. In addition to reeling in the normal everyday bass and stuff like that, he's out in the bays and he's catching all kinds of fish out there especially sharks, okay? Now he also has recently acquired a uh, DJ, DJI Mavic Pro drum. So um, I expect some more uh, aerial footage in the future. In fact, he's already done some of that already. Now he has had an interesting encounter with an alligator, but to see that, you'll have to check out his channel. Number four, Boost Bassin. Now he's a relatively new uh, YouTube angler and it looks like he's a multi-species fisherman. In addition to uh, documenting his catches, he's also done an MTB unboxing. Perhaps more to come in the future. He had an interesting day at the aquarium, but to see that, you'll have to check out his channel. Next, number five, is Fishing MD. This is another relatively new um, angler <clears throat> YouTube channel. Looks like he mainly targets the bass, but other species as well. He's also a kayak fisherman. And uh, he had an interesting visit with the police one day while he was fishing, but to see that, you'll have to check out his channel. Number six, set the hook catfishing. As the name implies, he is the catfish fisherman. And uh, he's also a fairly new YouTube angler. In addition to uh, documenting his catches, uh, he off also offers instructional material as well. And guys, he's caught some big ones, okay? So uh, check out his channel and give him some support. <clears throat> Number seven, Fishing Vibes. This is another young and new YouTube angler. Looks like he's mainly into catfishing, but other species as well. 
So he's new, so uh, head on over to his channel and give him some support. Number eight, Rock Creek Outdoors. Now this is another new YouTube channel by another young angler. However, he's also into uh, hunting and target shooting. In addition to documenting his catches, he has performed some product reviews, unboxings, and giveaways. He has also had a nasty occurrence with a treble hook. So if you want to see that episode, run on over to his channel and check that out and uh, give him some support. Now for the established YouTube angler. Um, Zofinger. Uh, well, when you read it, you want to say Zofinger, but I think it's really pronounced Zofinger or Zofinger. Um, I hope you heard of him, but if not, that's why I'm bringing it up because uh, uh, he's a great guy. He, he really is. And he's been around for quite a while. And he was a New Yorker that moved to Florida to do some construction work. And then, uh, and believe me, he is one heck of a master craftsman, which is evidenced by his um, early videos. But his friends turned him on to uh, kayaking and fishing, and then, you know, it just built up from there. Uh, he mainly fishes out, in the big bays and he has done one heck of a big huge boat project and he's still working on it it's great uh, in addition to documenting his catches he's done some product reviews and catch and cook videos what got him famous was all of his kayak modification projects i promise you will enjoy his channel now for my wild card as I said before in, in previous shout out videos, I'm into all kinds of other um, stuff like science and history and you know projects and stuff like that. So next one is Keystone Science. He's another one of those uh, <clears throat> backyard, kitchen, garage science channels. And a lot of his work revolves around electricity and electronics and do-it-yourself projects Concerning electricity, he's built Telsa coils and stun guns and EMP devices and uh, that he, you know, uses electricity on. And he's done some, um, oh, he's used electricity to create art. So if you want to see that, I promise you it's a very interesting channel and you can learn a lot from it. Please check it out. Well, guys, that's it. And until next time, you guys. Take care. Francis Kiefel and I approved this video.